What's going on YouTube? I am Daring the Bowtie Fragrance Guy, the fashion and fragrance guy. And I talk about men's fragrances on this channel. I talk about um, some lifestyle, fashion stuff as well. So if you're into that, make sure you hit subscribe. Make sure you hit the bell icon as well. So that way when I upload a new video, you'll get notified. So on today's video, guys, we're going to be jumping in a little bit more of that lifestyle uh, content. One of my favorite sayings of all time is that you never get a second chance to make a first impression because it is so true man uh what you're wearing when somebody first meets you what you look like all these different things obviously contribute to that first impression so today i want to talk about five of the first things that women notice about you when they initially meet you so this is going to be a really really fun topic uh, to cover i'm really excited to talk about this with you guys so if you want to see what i have to say then you guys know the routine. Keep it locked right here. Let's get it. The Bowtie Fragrance Guy. All right, guys, we are back. Thank you so much for keeping it locked in. Let's jump right into this video. Now, obviously, as I said before, and as you guys uh, very well know, this is a fragrance channel. And honestly, that is one of the first things that a lady is going to notice about you, and that is your scent. So I highly recommend that you guys have some kind of signature scent. Uh, this is one that I really, really enjoyed. I think you guys need to check out from the brand of Ormond Jane. This is Ormond Man. And this is a really spicy, kind of masculine fragrance. It just really smells great. Um, it has a note of hem black hemlock in here, which to me is kind of like almost like oak moss. It's kind of uh, earthy, kind of mossy uh, kind of note. But this thing is... It just smells great, guys. It really smells, in my opinion, like a man should smell. So that's why I think this is so aptly named because it's called Ormond Man. Most ladies really love a guy that really smells like a guy, if that makes sense. And this fragrance makes you or helps you to smell like a guy. Really well put together, really masculine. Just the right amount of spices and sweetness and stuff. And I think coriander is in here. So... It has some spiciness uh, to it. Like I said, a little bit of sweetness, a little touch of oud in here as well. Guys, this is just the perfect kind of signature scent for a man to smell like a man. And that's something that women really love and appreciate. So, guys, get yourself a good signature scent because one of the first things that ladies notice about you is the way that you smell. Now, secondly, guys, of course, one of the next things that a woman is going to notice when you first meet them is they're going to look, obviously, at your face now so making sure that uh, your uh, facial hair is well groomed is really 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 important uh, even if you're wearing like facial like stubble and stuff like that just make sure that it's, that it's lined up uh, really nicely obviously making sure that you're brushing your teeth that your hair is properly groomed and combed contingent upon what kind of style uh, that you're going for and obviously guys something that I really harp on on this channel is making sure that you're taking care of your skin and that's where of course Tej Hanley is going to come into play I've talked about Tej Hanley for a while because simply put it works it works it works it works and so I would like to share that with you guys some men really think that it's not masculine to take care of their skin or have some kind of skin regimen um, but it is really, really important that you do so, man. Uh, don't wait until you have a problem to address it. Don't wait till you have a breakout of some kind or uh, wrinkles or whatever the case may be, whatever you're dealing with before you do something about it. Be proactive. Uh, Teach Hanley has a really simple, easy to understand kind of skincare regimen, and that's why I really like it. Doesn't give you a whole lot to think about. And uh, you start with just a facial wash in the morning. Of course, wash your face, follow it up with the uh, AM moisturizer. So keep your skin moisturized, protected uh, throughout the course of the day. Uh, when you arrive home in the evening, of course, when you are showering, however you do it, I do kind of a sometimes a separate skincare regimen from the shower, but sometimes I do in the shower, depending on how much time I have or how tired I may be. Um, but of course, you want to wash 
with the facial wash again and then use the PM moisturizer uh, when you're about to lay down at night. Your skin needs to stay protected and moisturized as well while you sleep. All right. Of course, we're laying on the pillow, laying on our hands and things of that nature. So you want to make sure that your skin, again, is being protected while you're sleeping. And then the level one skin care system also comes with um, a facial scrub. So twice per week, you want to make sure that you're, that you're exfoliating your skin, you know, removing those dead skin cells, cleaning out your pores, getting deep down into your your pores. And that's what the facial scrub is for. Uh, so you just want to do that twice per week the way that I do it do it on Wednesday and I do it on Sunday. So kind of those midway, that midway point in the end of the week, um, you know, I want to use the, I use the facial scrub to make sure that I'm actually, you know, cleaning out my pores in the whole nine. So that's it guys. That's the basic level skin, um, level one skincare system. And um, obviously because you guys are my subscribers, you guys know how this works because you are my subscribers. T's Handley going to hook you up. If you decide that you need to, um, I really want to start a skincare regimen that's going to work. They're going to hook you up with a free gift and also a discount on your first box. Okay, so make sure that you click the link down below. Get started with a skincare regimen that works. They're actually going to throw in that free gift for you. And of course, you're going to have a skincare regimen now in your life that is going to be a surefire thing that's going to help make sure that you are looking your best every single day, guys. So don't delay. Make sure you click down the link down below. And make sure you go ahead and get started with a skincare regimen that works. Now, the next thing that ladies really notice on a guy is going to be your shoes. Guys, I can't tell you, you know, uh, or emphasize this particular point or drive it home enough. Women are really paying attention to your shoes, guys. And whether you are wearing some type of sneakers or you are wearing a more dressy uh, style shoe, women are paying attention to that. One of the worst things you can do is come into... Uh, an environment and meeting a lady for the first time and your shoes are dirty or they are run over and god forbid guys get rid of the square toe shoes all right i can't tell you how many times i've seen a guy get dressed up and the shoes are horrible all right so don't be that guy man don't don't be that guy that has considered everything about the way he looks as far as his outfit his presentation and the whole nine and your shoes are busted. I'm telling you right now, that's one of the major ways that uh, you can strike out with a lady because they are really paying attention to those shoes. Hey, man, they said it back in the day. Jordan said it, man. It's got to be the shoes. Uh, one of the next things that women really notice first about a guy is his smile. All right, so, and that that really goes without saying, guys, I talked earlier about grooming, making sure that you're brushing your teeth. I, I would even include your breath in this. You know what I'm saying? So make sure that you're brushing your teeth and things of that nature to make sure uh, that your smile uh, from the standpoint of your presentation is as best that it can be. Look, not everybody's blessed with that million dollar smile, but you can work with what you have. So again, making sure you are visiting the dentist on a regular basis uh, to make sure that your, uh, your smile is, you know, as best that it can be uh, with what you were given naturally, making sure that you're brushing your teeth, making sure that you're... Uh, like I said, your breath is smelling good in the whole nine. Obviously, it's going to be something that uh, women notice. I can't tell you how many times I've heard a woman say, I really, really love his smile. Honestly, that has gotten some guys <laughs> in the door, man, because women really pay attention uh, to your smile, guys. So make sure it's taking care of your face, but also making sure that you're taking care of your teeth as well. And last but not least, guys, women are really paying attention to your hands. All right, now listen, I'm not one of those guys that goes to a, a salon and actually gets a actual manicure. I've actually done that twice in my life, but that's not something that I do on a regular basis. But that does not mean that make sure that you're clipping your uh, fingernails and things of that nature and kind of filing them and making sure that they are they're, they're clean, your nails are not um, dirty, that they're clean. Those are things that you can do to make sure uh, that you are taking care of your hands as well. And God forbid, guys, put lotion on, put some kind of moisturizer on your hands, especially when it starts to get into the cooler months like we're transitioning to right now. Uh, it is very easy, especially for us as African-Americans, to uh, have white ash on our hands, as we call it. And uh, if you look like you've been working at a flower factory all day, trust me, and your hands are really rough, when you go to greet a woman, that is a turnoff. I don't care how masculine you think you are, you are, whatever the case may be. 
fellas, women are paying attention to your hands. Trust me. So make sure that your skin, your hands are moisturized. Make sure again that your nails are at least clipped and kind of filed down uh, and are not dirty and you are good to go. So make sure guys that you're also taking care of those hands because she's going to look at you and say, hey, but you know, I'm not letting you touch me with those hands if they look like you've been working in a flower factory all day and you got calluses and stuff all over your hands. Take care of your hands, fellas. Trust me. But that is it, gentlemen. That is my time. I hope you enjoyed this video today. As always, I sincerely appreciate your time and your attention to these videos. I know you guys don't have to watch, but you do, and I sincerely appreciate that. Now, don't forget to take a few moments out to like, comment, and subscribe. And make sure you are sharing these videos out to some other folks out there that you think could use the information or find it entertaining. Because I'm your guy, Darren. I'm the Bowtie Fragrance Guy. I love to look good, and of course, I love to smell amazing so until next time guys keep looking good keep smelling even better i'll catch you on the flip side peace <laughs>